hey guys welcome back to next gen blog and in this video i want to show you how you can create a gunfire effect in vscc free video editor so it's actually super easy to create a gunfire effect in vsdc so without further delay let's get started and see how you can do this now as you can see i've already imported my demo video in the editor so the first thing which we will do is we will write some text on top of the screen and so to do that go to add object go to text click on text and then click on ok now mark your text object on top of the screen like this and then click on this particular option which says set the same size as the parent has now let's write some text inside the text box so let me just write let's say subscribe and let me just center align my text perfect let me also change the text color from white to orange and let me also increase the text size to somewhere around let's say 300 pixels maybe it's a bit too much so somewhere around 250 pixels perfect all right now the next thing which i would like to do is i would like to overlap my video and the text object by one second right at the end and so let me just move my text object towards the right side and let me just place it at so the duration of my video is 14 second 200 millisecond so i will place my text object at 13 second 200 millisecond perfect now the next thing which you need to do is double click on the video and then go to video effects go to transitions select mosaic and then click on ok now look inside the mosaic settings which is present inside the properties window and inside the type currently spiral in is selected so click on this drop down list and select random now directly option is set to false so that's fine inside the gradient length currently the value is 50% so change this from 50 to 0 and inside the cell size option currently in pixels is selected so click on this drop down list and select by size divider perfect make sure that the value inside cell width divider and cell height divider is 1 and now let me just quickly play the video for you so this is the gunfire effect perfect and one thing is miss which is missing is the gunfire sound and so i downloaded this sound from the youtube audio library so let me just import that so let me just go to add object go to click on audio and then let me just select my sound effect which I downloaded from YouTube audio library and then click on open and then click on OK. Now I need to reduce the duration of my audio to one second, 200 millisecond. Perfect. And now place it right at the end like this perfect and so now if i just quickly play the video for you so this is the gunfire effect so i need to increase the volume of my sound effect so let me just double click on the video click on the audio file and right here you will find this audio volume option so let me just increase the audio volume by 10 decibels 
and now let me just quickly play the video for you once again perfect so this is how you can create a gunfire effect in vscc free video editor do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see in the next video till then thanks for watching